why not cheese? So many of us love cheese and dig in our heels when we are asked to give it up. Eating enough calcium-rich foods helps support your immune system, which relies on the calcium from fruits, leafy greens, herbs, wild foods, and some vegetables. Did you know that your immune system is constantly using up calcium to save your thyroid? Cheese and other dairy products contain a lot of fat, which is a strain for your digestive system, and especially your liver, uh, to process. And cheese contains lactose, and the combination of fat and sugar has negative effects on health. Fat in your bloodstream helps viruses and bacteria proliferate because the fat in the blood doesn't allow the immune system to easily seek out, find, and destroy the pathogens. And according to Anthony William, dairy is mucus producing because the viruses and bacteria eating on the lactose and proteins cause inflammation and allergies. The addictive effects of cheese are apparently due to its containing large amounts of protein, casein, present in milk, but at much higher levels in cheese because how it's made. Casein activates the opioid system, inducing pleasure, and who doesn't want that?